engine compartment. Believe me, it's hard to keep those things clean sometimes. Well, at least in what I do. 2003 Kenworth W900L, truck number 49, Jeff Blum. Our truck is uh, 2003 Kenworth W900, it's owned by Jeff Blum, uh, DJ Transportation out of Connecticut. It's got a drone hood, 18 speed, 308 rear, it's got an ARI, 98 inch ARI sleeper on it. Uh, the truck's an 03, it's a second generation cab, it was ordered as a day cab, but it's saying all the bumping that was going on. Uh, front bumper is all custom stainless, uh, a lot of the engine is all chrome, not too much bolt on stuff there. Most of all the other stuff that you see on there we put on ourselves come from Pride and Glory Comb Shop in North Haven, Connecticut. Uh, it's got Taylor boxes on it, WCI Thunders. It's got a shower, bathroom, full kitchen in there, uh, factory GPS. Truck's a lot of fun to drive. A really a lot of fun to drive. The best part about it is getting the driver. You know. uh, we do flatbed and uh, drop deck type work. A lot of stuff for General Electric, Georgia Pacific, anything from jet engines to lumber we haul, you know. It's got quite a different variety of customers. That's about it. <laughs> Next we have for the best retro trucks, we have a six out of the whole bunch. That means the old school cool truck goes to Randy Brown for his beat. Come on, Cowboy. The 1980 cap, the chassis is a 98, it was a conventional, but we took the, the front springs off it and the cab mount, took the cab mount and took the cab over, redrilled the front of the frame and mounted the, this cab onto the newer frame. So it's, it's got the 80s look, but it's got New technology for the motors, this electronic uh, four and a quarter, I know, 475 cat, and it's got the new version of the Freightliner Air Ride. So going down the road, this thing does not feel like it's a, it's a 1980 truck. It, it rides very well and handles very well, and it has lots of, lots of power. You might know you're going to break back. I can come in and drill always. And the best of show combination for a non-working class. Even though it was a while of working, question to be in this category for a 379 Peterbilt 2005 goes to Vinny Dioria. Well, 
we just redid it. It was purple and white before with flames and everything on the hood and uh, just changed. It's seven years old, so just made a change. Tried this. Just change, change colors to change the floor. For the best of show, working combination, 2003 Peterbilt 379 extension hood goes to Mark Boyd. This is a 2004 379X Peterbilt. Got a 2004 Kentucky trail on the back, and all exotic cars, muscle cars, classic cars, motorcycles. All over the country. Uh, we did some stainless here and there, and a lot of chrome work on the engine, and basic stuff like that. We put a tile floor inside here. And that's about it, I guess. It's got an ISX Cummins in it, sounds really cool. And it's a nice little truck, it goes down the road with it, you know. Did a lot of looks. Customers really appreciate the look of it when I pick up their million dollar cars. And Kind of goes with the whole package, you know. Man, thanks for coming to the show, man. Thanks everybody for coming. You guys have a great day.